it is required to find the volume bounded by the cylinder x square plus y square equal to 4 and the planes y plus z is equal to 4 and z equal to 0. So this is your cylinder x square plus y square is equal to 4 and the plane is y plus z is equal to 4 and z equal to 0. Right? Okay. Now it is clear from the figure that z is to be integrated over the circle x square plus y square equal to 4 in the xy plane because it is in the xy plane so half of the region is shaded for the circle right so the required volume will become now twice double integral z dx dy right this is the formula but the required volume will be twice all right <clears throat> I'm having z over here because I need the value of z which we can get from the plane. So from here you can get z as 4 minus y. So z is 4 minus y. Okay. And now the limits for x and limits for y. Because in the innermost integral I'm having dx. So limits of x will be in the form of y. This is your origin right so limits of x will go from 0 to and at here on this curve the value of x is please get the value of x from here that is 4 minus y square square root so it is square root of 4 minus y square and in the outermost integral i'm having dy so the limits of y should be constant if you put x equal to 0 over here in the equation of the cylinder, you get y as plus minus 2. And from the graph also, I'm having this is your negative 2 and this is positive 2. So y is varying from negative 2 to positive 2 for this shaded area. So this is minus 2 to 2. So this is minus 2 to 2 and this is 0 to square root of 4 minus y square so let's solve this required volume all right so this is equal to twice the limits minus 2 to 2 and 0 to 4 minus y square under the root and the value of z you have to put the value of z that is 4 minus y so this is 4 minus y dx dy Okay, so this is twice minus 2 to 2. What is the integration for this with respect to x? It is 4 minus y into x. And the limits 0 to 4 minus y square under the root. Putting the value, the upper limit, this is 4 minus y square root of 4 minus y square. Putting 0, you get 0. So I am splitting this now. This is 4 times taking 4 outside. Square root of 4 minus y square dy minus twice minus 2 to 2. And this is y square root of 4 minus y square dy. Please notice here, this is your odd function. And whenever the limits are same, having the opposite sign, and the function is odd, the integral becomes 0. And because this is your even function, right? This is your even function. And the limits are same, having the opposite sign, then this integral will be twice, but the limits will be from 0 to 2, right? Square root of 4 minus y square dy. And this is 8. Is it okay? Fine. This is the property I have used. Okay. So this becomes 16. This is 16. And this is integration from 0 to 2. 4 minus y square square root dy. 
Okay, now what is the integration for square root of 4 minus y square? If you notice here, if you take this as your a square, the formula is y over 2 square root of 4 minus y square plus a square by 2. a square is 4. So this is 4 by 2 sine inverse y over a. a is 2 here. 4 is a square, so a will be 2. And then this is 16. All right. Putting 2 over here, I get 0 for the first term. Putting 2 over here, I get this will be 2. Sine inverse 1. Then minus. When you put 0 over here, you get 0. When you put 0 over here, you get 0. So this is 32 sine inverse 1. What is sine inverse 1? It is pi by 2. So you get 16 pi as your required answer. Alright, thank you.